Okay, Larry said the Nemecoloptrus' nest is at the top of a tree that's right next to a huge moss-covered rock. Look! Oh, nice job, Tiny. Let's go, team! Oh, boy! I can't wait to check out the view and stretch out in the great big nest! Can't stretch out! Well, I can't see the view, Tiny. Your whole head is in my face. How's the view up there? Should have known Larry would forget to mention something. From the looks of it, the Nemecoloptrus family must not be any higher than my knee. <laughs> not even a foot tall. We may need to get a ladder. And a bigger nest. Hang on. I'm coming for you, buddy. Where am I going to put my shell? Where can I play dino ball? Now, kids, sometimes vacations can be full of surprises. Like the living situation. We have to keep looking at the bright side. Right. Sure, the Nemecoloptrus family is apparently way, way, way smaller than us, <laughs> but maybe we can learn a lot about them. <laughs> Wouldn't that be fun? Great idea, Dad. First, let's learn what they eat. I'm starving. Oh, me too, buddy. Let's go fishing in Nemecoloptrus Lake. Yay! Uh, Dad? That kid is eating a bug. Yeah, that one too. Is anyone here looking for fish? Do they even have fish? Well, I'm sure there's fish around here somewhere. Why don't you kids go over and introduce yourselves? Good idea, Mom. Hi, I'm Tiny Pteranodon, and these are my sister and brothers, Shiny, Don, and Buddy. Hi, I'm Nelly Nemecolopterus. And I'm Nancy Nemecolopterus. Wow, you guys are tiny. And I like Tiny. Nemecoloptrus makes me feel like a giant. <laughs> <laughs> um, do you mind if we compare features? It's kind of my thing. Oh, sure. So you're both pterosaurs, like my sisters and brother. You both have wings and beaks with no teeth. That's right. We eat bugs. You eat bugs? Mm, nothing like freshly caught bugs. You want to try? Ooh, thanks. I love bugs. Um, it tastes like bug. <laughs> yeah? One another? Um, no thanks. We're good. Moving on. I see that your feet are different from pteranodons. Your claws are more curved than theirs. Yeah, our claws help us grip tree branches when we climb. And our flatter feet help us walk faster. <laughs> oh, I'm okay. <laughs> wow, it's amazing that pterosaurs come in all different shapes and sizes. Don't you think? <laughs> Glad you've made some new friends. Is anybody hungry for fish? No, thanks. Yes! <laughs> well, it's getting late, so let's go back to the nest. Say goodbye to your new friends for now. Bye, Nellie and Nancy. Good to compare features with you. Bye. Really, <laughs> Dawn, stop that journey. All right, team. We just need to keep positive. <laughs> if we curl up into little balls like this, you see, I'm... Super comfortable. The perfect sleeping position. And try it. But why can't we sleep in the nest that Mom and Buddy made down there? Yeah, Buddy can't fly, so it's not safe for him to sleep in a nest this high off the ground. And your mom volunteered to sleep down there with him so he wouldn't be alone. Oh. Come on, let's try sleeping like the Nemecoloptrus do. It'll be fun. Okay, Dad. Hey, move over. You see? Plenty of room. <laughs> Good night. Good night. Good night, kids. Good night, buddy. Good night, Mom. Dinosaur once upon a time, there was a mom. Her name was Mrs. Pteranodon. Sitting on her nest, she heard a scratching and said, Oh, boy, my eggs are hatching. One by one.